guys, it's Chris Braverman. Today I am reviewing these lovely Rugrats plush dolls. So I found these guys at Toys R Us. Um, I was originally fig hunting uh, for WWE action figures. I did find my WWE action figures, of course, but then I found these beautiful little dudes and it took me back to the 90s, took me back to my childhood, took me back to everything I loved about being a child. And I said, I've got to own these plush dolls. Uh, very fond of the Rugrats. Uh, huge Rugrats fan, of course. Um, and I wanted to spread, you know, the, the awesomeness of Rugrats with my children. So I got these guys because my kids, they love playing with plush dolls. Um, so I thought, why not add the Rugrats to our collection? So here they are. Uh, we've got Tommy Pickles there, Chucky Finster, Angelica, and the twins, Philip and Lillian, Phil and Lil for short. Um, so let's let's do this. Let's start off with Lillian here. Lil, let's look at her, and she looks just like her cartoon counterpart, of course, with the little dress there and the ducky. She's got a heart uh, sticking out of this pocket here, and she's got the whole shebang going on, the whole outfit with the dress and then the undershirt and the diapie and you know the shoes there matching attire pretty cool of course by Nickelodeon there's the back of her head her little patch of hair the top of her head and the bow which you know she's very iconic for and the twins are very iconic for that bow because um you know when you switch the bow you can't tell which one is which remember they used to pull that whole uh, twin magic thingamajig on the show. Yeah. Um, who's up next? Let's go with, with, with Philip. Phil. Here. And yeah, so he looks just like his sister. There are twins. Um, you know, facial features are the same. We're pretty much the same getup. And if, like I said, if you switch over that bow at the top of her head onto his, then he'll look just like Lillian. And you can, you know, do the whole switcheroo. Um, so he's got, you know, this top here. It's not a dress like hers. But top's pretty much the same with the ducky and the little heart sticking out of the uh, pocket there. He's got blue shorts and, you know, blue kicks, which is pretty cool. Um, the, the purplish, beige undershirt, just like his sis. He's got a little smirk going on, looking to the side and, you know, looking for some worms and some mud to play in, I suppose. There's a the patch of hair at the top. And he's pretty cool. I like the Phil and Lil duo here. Let me see if I can pick them up with one. Oh yeah, the twins, there you go. Next up, we will move on to Angelica Pickles. Uh, you know, their, their nemesis, their Emini on the show. Um, so she is the cousin of Tommy Pickles, but she's a brat. And um, you know, constantly trying to trick the children into doing crazy things and, and just tormenting and pestering them. Um, that's Angelica Pickles for you. Um, so she's got the whole get up going on. Uh, also looks like her real life, um, excuse me, cartoon counterpart. She looks pretty cool, like the whole pigtails thing going on. And she's got the little bow bands, purple bow bands, um, tying the pigtails together, the yellow hair. She's got a little smirk kind of, you know, passing off as a little angel. When Meanwhile, we all know she's not an angel. She's mean. Um, what else? She's got a uh, purple dress, an orange and black undershirt, and these little tights there that are uh, blue with green, just like Angelica Pickles on the show. Uh, purple kicks with white and what appear to be orange socks. Angelica Pickles. Take a look at the back of Angelica. Um, so I, I'm wondering if they made, uh, what's her name? Her doll, remember the doll? I, oh my god, how could I forget? It's not Susie. Susie Carmichael is an entirely different character. What was her doll's name? Come on. Um, I just had it at the tip of my tongue and it just left right now. The doll, you know, with the crazy patches of hair. <laughs> what was her name? Oh my god, how could I have forgotten? Oh man, oh man, no, 
I'm sorry, I drew a blank there. If I find, if I figure it out at the end of this video, I will gladly announce it. But how could I have forgotten? But anyway, what I was going to say is I wish they had that doll. I think they do actually, but I just didn't get it. No, no, they didn't have it. Maybe they made it, but it wasn't there to purchase that day. So if they do have it, I'm gonna go look for it. Whatever the name of her doll was. Uh, Chucky Finster here, the Finst, as I used to call him. Uh, so Tommy Pickles' best friend, uh, the crazy orangish, reddish hair. He's got the freckles going on, the cute little glasses, and his Bucky Beaver teeth. Um, the iconic Chucky Finster shirt, which is blue with red, and of course, you know, this planet there. Um, what's going on? Green shorts with like lightish green uh, patterned. Red kicks with white. This is iconic Chucky Finster. Tommy's BFF. And finally, the main event of the evening. We all know who he is. The star of the show. The mega diaper baby here. Tommy Pickles. Um, so he is, uh, what is the word? <laughs> he embodies what a baby is. And, and should look like pretty much um, pretty plain little character but of course he was the uh, the main character in Rugrats um, everything revolved a lot of the situations revolved around him um, so like I said he's uh, the staple for the show and you know very iconic image of what a baby <laughs> looks like so he's got the diapies going on um, mom and dad often did not dress him properly you know always left him in, in diapies where were her, where was his shorts mom and dad huh what if he caught a cold mom and dad why only diapies and then this uh cute little blue t-shirt there uh which you know showing off his belly button um no socks nothing at all like his, his parents were just like negligent i suppose they didn't they didn't cover him up what if little dude got sick you know Stu, what's going on and Didi. Come on, why didn't you guys like cover up your child? And, you know, for his warmth. Why? <laughs> but anyway, um, yeah, it looks just like his cartoon counterpart. Um, bald head. You know, just like one, two, three, four, five, six patches of, not patches, but little strings of hair. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all there is to it. It's Tommy Pickles. These Rugrats plush dolls are awesome. I found them at Toys R Us, but I have seen them at Target as well. Don't know if they're available at Walmart because I haven't seen, um, but I know that they are at Target as well because I have seen them. But definitely try Toys R Us because that's where you will find them. A lot of uh, Nickelodeon nostalgic things, uh, figures and plush dolls are being released. So that's your best bet, go to Toys R Us. Um, and yeah, they're pretty cool. I love them. They look just like um, the characters from the cartoon show. Um, pretty, nice nostalgia pieces to add to uh you know your home if you like collecting things like i do then definitely add it to your collection uh if you want to just you know throw them on your bed and just remember uh the cool times that you had as a child watching rugrats you know the the awesome memories and all the craziness that ensued on the tv show then definitely add these uh plush dolls to your collection and that's pretty much it guys thank you for watching hope you guys like these plush dolls as much as I do. Uh, if you have any comments, please leave them in the comment box below. Subscribe to my channel here on YouTube, youtube.com slash Chris Braverman. Follow me on Instagram at Chris Braverman. Got a lot of giveaways going on, giving away uh, toys, action figures, video games, consoles, gift cards, a lot of things. So definitely follow me on Instagram at Chris Braverman uh, so you don't miss out on the action. And of course, visit my website, chrisbraverman.com for so much more. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time.